welcome. I'm Sarah of Rich Textures Crochet and today we are going to learn how to crochet the spider stitch. That's the stitch that you see here in front of you. Now the spider stitch is a fairly dense stitch. It's made up of single crochet stitches that uh, are worked in V stitches into the space down below. Uh, but because they're only single crochet Vs, it creates quite a dense fabric. The fabric is the same on the front and the back, and it really is uh, quite pretty. So that's the stitch that we're going to work on today. I'm going to be using a six millimeter crochet hook along with the Karen Times Pantone yarn by Yarn Inspirations. And I'll provide a link in the notes for the video on both of these items if you would like to learn more. So thank you so much for joining me and I invite you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, then grab a hook and some yarn and we're going to learn how to crochet the spider stitch. For our stitch today, the spider stitch, it is worked in rows. So we're going to start by making a slip knot and then work a foundation chain and your foundation chain can be any uh, odd number of stitches plus two. So today I'm going to start by working 17 stitches plus two more so I'll have a total of 19. Eighteen and nineteen. We're then going to start our row one, and we're going to start by working a single crochet stitch into the second chain from hook. So count in one, two, and I'm going to single crochet into that second chain. I'm then going to, into the next chain, I'm going to work a V-stitch of a single crochet, chain one, and single crochet into that third chain. So single crochet, chain one, and single crochet stitch. You're then going to skip the next chain and then into the next one, work another single crochet V. So single crochet, chain one, and single crochet. You're going to repeat that all the way across. Skip one, into the next chain, single crochet, chain one, and single crochet. Do that all the way across, and then you will work a single crochet stitch into that final chain stitch. So I'm skipping the next chain and single crochet in the final stitch. For row two, you're going to chain one and turn your work and you're going to single crochet into the top of that first stitch. Next, you're going to be working into those chain one spaces of the V stitches and you're going to simply work more V's. So single crochet into that chain one space, chain one and single crochet. Repeat. Uh, Skip the next two stitches into that chain one, single crochet, chain one, and single crochet. You're going to do that all the way across. And you can see why this stitch is so dense, but it's also very pretty. Stitch, single crochet, chain one, 
single crochet all into those chain one spaces then you're going to skip that next stitch and into the top of that first single crochet work a single crochet stitch you're then going to chain one turn your work and you're going to repeat that row over and over again for as long as you would like your pattern to continue so single crochet in the first stitch then into the next chain one space single crochet chain one single crochet repeat that in every chain one space all the way across and that's all there is to working this spider stitch so thank you so much for joining me and uh, be sure to subscribe to my channel and i look forward to seeing you again soon happy crocheting bye